Good day everyone! I'm Bautista Shinami A from Bitala 3A. For this video, I will recite the parts of sewing machine. The upper parts of sewing machine and their function. The upper parts is composed of first, head. Head is the complete sewing machine without cabinet or stand. Second, arm. Arm is the curved part of the head containing mechanism or operating the needle. Third, bed. Bed is the flat portion of the machine and beneath is the feed dog where it is mounted. And the shuttle and lower thread are placed. Basic sewing machine parts and its function. First, spool pin. The spool pin holds the spool thread for you making it easier for you to thread your machine and keep the thread coming as you want it to. Second, bobbin cover. Covers and protects the bobbin holder while sewing. A needle pushes the thread through the fabric to form a stitch. Third, feed dog. The teeth directly under the presser foot that fold the fabric forward while sewing. Fourth, bobbin winder spindle. Bobbin is placed here during winding. Bobbin winder stopper. Stop winding the bobbin when it reaches capacity. Sixth, spool thread and the bobbin thread. The bobbin is threaded by the spool thread by being placed on the bobbin winder spindle, which is on top of the machine. Seventh, spool thread comes from the top of the machine and goes through the upper thread guide, while the bobbin thread is the under needle and goes through the bobbin thread guide. Eighth, throat plate. It is the window of the feed dog and it's where the bobbin threads came out. Nine, slide plate. It is a movable plate that covers its shuttle and bobbin case. 10. Shuttle. Shuttle it holds the bobbin case while sewing. 11. Bobbin. It is a metal spool for winding thread. Parts of the sewing machine in the arm. Thread take. Up lever releases the thread that interlocks with the bobbin thread. Presser bar lifter. Moves the presser foot. Tension controls the looseness and tightness of stitches. Needle bar. Needle bar holds the needle in place. Needle clump. Holds and tightens the needles. Presser foot. Holds the fabric in place while sewing. Needle. is a slender tool attached in the needle clump used for sewing. Stitch regulator. Checks the length of the stitches. Balance wheel. Set the mechanism in motion. Belt. Connect the balance wheel to drive wheel. Stop motion is screw, hinders moving when loose and start. Parts of the sewing machine under the bed. First, throat plate. It's the windows of the feed dog and it is the where the bobbin threads came out. Slide plate. It's the movable plate that covers the shuttle and bobbin case. The lower parts of the lock stitch sewing machine. First, bond wheel. Leads the balance wheel through the belt connection. Second, band wheel crank moves the band wheel. Third, pitman rod holds the treadle to band wheel crank. Fourth, belt guide holds the belt to its place. Fifth, belt shifter removes the belt from the wheel. Sixth, dress guard protects the dress from the wheel. Seven, Treadle is where the feet are stationed to drive the band wheel through the pitman rod. 8. Legs. Support the cabinet of the machine. Last. Cabinet. Holds the head of the machine by interlocking screw on the hinge. And that's all. Thank you.